Hello, in this video I will show you how to install my DLP server. For this, I'll use the ISO image downloaded from mydlp.com. I will mount the ISO image to my virtual machine. You can also do this on your physical machine. And I'll reset the machine. After the reboot, uh, I'll choose the installation language, select Install My DLP Appliance, select the system uh, language, select the location. Then I'll select the keyboard layout. I'll wait for the progress. I have a DHCP server in my local area network. If you don't have DHCP server, you can also set a static IP configuration. Network configuration succeeded. I'll enter the username and I'll enter the password and type the password again to verify. I choose not to encrypt my home directory and I'll set the uh, time zone. I'll select the uh, to write to com changes to my hard disk. Wait for the partitioning and installation of packages. After the installation finished, the machine reboots. It can take a while uh, on your system. And I wait for my DRP start. When I see the login prompt, it means my DLP started. I'll enter my username and password. I'll check my DHCP configuration. Yeah, I have an IP. As you can see here, you can also set static IP configuration. And then uh, I use my IP address and type it onto my browser. I need to enter a license code uh, to use MyDLP. I go to secure.mydlp.com portal and I type my uh, email address to get a license. You will use your own email address. Select the license type. We will select the enterprise in this demonstration. Uh, enter your name, surname, company name, and password for the secure.mydlp.com portal. Click the register button. I'll verify my email address. And after the verification, I'll have my license key. I'll copy this license key. 
and passed it into a MyDAP user interface. Yeah, my license is verified. I'll type default password MyDLP and uh, user MyDLP. And I can see my policy screen. Thanks for watching this video.